the big news around Clemson, you just got a new offensive coordinator, Garrett Riley, came from TCU. What, how, how, how much uh, knowledge did you have of that process when it was happening? And, like, is that something that Coach Sweeney, as the starting quarterback, talks to you about when he's making those decisions? And then how excited are you to have – one of the best young minds in college football as your, as your coach. Yeah. Yeah. I think, I think, um, we were all a little bit surprised. Um, but it was, it was pretty new. I mean, coach Sweeney told me he was thinking about it. Um, let's see. What was that? Was that like Saturday, maybe yeah. Friday, I think it was maybe Friday or something ago, like that. Yeah. A couple of days ago, he told me in the morning he was thinking about it. Um, thinking about making a decision. Um, and I was like, okay. Um, and then, like three hours later, he was like, yeah, we're, uh, um, you know, I, I just made a decision, uh, come up to my office when you have a second. I was like, all right. And, you know, he, he told me he made the decision. Um, and, you know, I probably one of my favorite people at Clemson is Coach Streeter, um, without a doubt, like top, top two favorite people, um, since I've been here. Uh, he, he is without a doubt one of the most loving people that I've ever met. I mean, we started every single film session, uh, which is 15, 20 minutes. You know, it doesn't matter if we had a 30 minute meeting and that's all we had or an hour and a half, at least 15 minutes every day. He just go around the room and ask how we're all doing. Um, yeah. And he's not looking for a one word answer. He's looking for, you know, yeah. how's your parents doing? How are your siblings doing? Um, you know, how's your girlfriend? How's this? How's that? And like really trying to get to know you, um, you know, how's your faith doing? How's this? Um, and just like, I remember just sitting there like, and I even, I've said this to them, like in the room, like, like this is so rare. Like yeah. that we just get to sit in a room and not talk about football mm -hmm. in a college football atmosphere for like 10 minutes. Yeah. Like I just remember sitting in a room, like, I don't, I don't think anybody else is doing this in the country. Um, and that was just, that was just so special to me. And like, he just go around the room. Like, I remember in Miami, like day before the game, he was like, I just want you to go around each person, go around the room and tell me what you're thankful for, for each person in the room. And like, that's just like so rare. Um, and that was just so cool to me. Like somebody that just loves on people so well, um, and just loves what he does so well that he's using that opportunity to just, just care on people. Um, so, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm going to miss him a ton and I'm, I'm going over at his place tonight and, and going to go hang out with them for a little bit. But, you know, at the same time on the flip side, um, I'm, I'm really excited about coach Riley. Uh, he recruited me a little bit at SMU and, oh, you right. know, a, a local, a local Texas guy also. <laughs> So, you know, we've, we've talked almost every day so far since he's been here and we got to go to the Duke basketball, uh, Clemson Duke basketball game the other day. Um, and you know, we know, we know so many people, uh, just connections and yeah. stuff. We know so many people, um, you know, like one of my high school coaches, his son is like one of coach Riley's right hand man. And like, uh, coach Riley actually like bought my high school head coach's haircut one time when they're both at the same barbershop. <laughs> like they just know so many people. We just both know so many people and um, we've gotten along super well, but you know, I'm, I'm excited about what he's going to bring. And you know, Clemson has been really, really good for a long time now. Mm -hmm. And I think it's, I'm excited just to a, a new spark that he's going to bring. So. Yeah. I mean, it shows how prominent coach Sweeney and Clemson is to go get someone like Garrett yeah. Riley who just, yeah. who just was in the national championship game. I saw he got a, he got introduced at the at the basketball yeah. game, right? It was like he was a head coach, man. He was I, I, that's what I was saying. It I was mean, a that's fun a, ovation. That's a saying. rare thing, right there. <laughs> yeah, it was impressive. So, are you as as far as like learning the offense, the new system? Is all the terminology going to change? Like, and are you you know when it comes to, to learning, are, are you is it something that you think about? Like, how am I going to learn this new system so fast? What yeah. are your thoughts on that? Um, yeah, it'll be, it'll be a new system. Mm -hmm. uh, it'll be Coach Riley's system, and you know there, there's some there's some great things that Clemson's been doing in this offense for a while that I think will stay. Um, but you know, they're, they're figuring it all out right now. Coach, Coach Riley was like, just stay patient with me. You know, we got it. You know, we kept our whole O staff. Um, the only change we made was with Coach Riley and every other position is the exact same and all the support staff is the exact same. So, you know, they're, they're going to be talking this through for a couple of weeks and figuring out how they're going to do all this and, so he just said, stay patient with me and, and we'll figure it out and I'll let you know soon. But, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I am.